Hi folks, um, Paul Stamets here, and nature has been a great teacher, and hopefully I've been a good student, but I want to show you something that I sort of interpolated from my experiences in watching mycelium grow. Right here is a massive lens of the mycelium um, of a very interesting mushroom that's currently used in medical clinical studies. But underneath these logs here, and you can think of wood chips as being a fast fuel. It's like you throw wood chips into a wood stove and they burn really quickly. Uh, bigger ch uh, chunks of wood, like logs, burn more slowly. So in the same sense, we're, these logs and wood chips are fuel for the mushroom mycelium. So the mycelium will grow through wood chips very quickly, but they decompose quickly, but the logs don't. So check this out. So this is a massive lens of mycelium. It's kind of a mother patch, and this patch can be expanded. Now, it may look fairly nondescript and interesting, but come closer. These logs were laid down after mycelium was transferred at about a 5% inoculation rate, one bucket to 20 buckets of wood chips. Mycelium grown on grain, then put into wood chips, and then expanded. So, but here are the logs, and... Here's a massive amount of mycelium. Now, when you pull this back, the mycelium is now attached to these logs. It's growing into the logs. Now, it's just not, just not these two. It should be in all of these now. And so, yep. And so you basically, look at this one. Oh, this is a nice one here. So we're creating a mycelial raft of logs. So these rafts are in the sea of mycelium here. You can transfer these. You can put them down into more wood chips. Now it's got a leaping off point. Uh, because the wood this size will take longer to decompose, it's a good um, nexus point for expansion of the mycelium. Look at here. Look at this. Look how thick this is. This is really gorgeous mycelium. So uh, the art and the science of mushroom culture converges from a laboratory into being able to generate mycelium outside that acclimates and it, it, it builds up its own immune system and then it sets off the microbiome so the other resident microflora to be helpful in its fulfillment of its life cycle so the great partnerships are going on very elaborate very complex and we barely know anything about them but this is a great mycelial raft log to then transfer to your friends Hey, Pam, you want this log? <laughs> or to whomever. Anyhow, uh, what other greater gift than the gift of mycelium? So happy holidays to you all. And may your mycelium run with glee, pleasure, and be bountiful in its fruitings.